the young sisters um, that we looked at in the second half of the SMU game is they uh, they got a lot of offensive rebounds. Um, so I think what we have to do is kind of focus on that because South Carolina is another athletic team that's going to crash the boards hard. So um, definitely boxing down our guys is a point of emphasis going into this game. Mm -hmm. Was it a pleasant surprise the way you guys played in New York, would you say? Yeah, I mean, we know what we're capable of, but um, just going out there and, and seeing us play like that, it's just a big confidence boost for everybody. What about you specifically? I mean, were you maybe not surprised, but <coughs> pleased with the your ability to just get the things done in the efficient way off the bench that you were? Yeah, um, you know, it's, that's my job, bringing yeah. a, a spark off the bench, and uh, I thought I did a good job overall both the, the games and MSG to, you know, bring that spark and be a guy that um, can, you know, do his role off the bench. Have you really, like, made a, like, mental adjustments now that, you know, you go from starting last year to now, you know, having this big role, kind of being, like, the sixth guy off the bench? Um, not much of adjustment, it's just um, not starting the game. This is pretty much the only thing, like, role is still the same. Anybody need there? Um, you know, bring energy off the bench is, you know, what I'm supposed to do. So that's what I'm going to bring every game. Could you have – go ahead. I know this time last year you kind of had a – I don't want to put words in your mouth, but a rough start a little bit, and you, you lost that starting job for a little bit. Was there anything in the, I guess, preseason practices that you took from last year that you kind of applied to this year to have a stronger start? Yeah, I mean, if there's anything I learned from last year, that you know, there's going to be ups and downs in the season. So um, just trying to get off to the best start as possible, and um, it's good to have, you know, four good wins under our belt and, you know, just kind of keep it going forward. When did you really see DJ's metamorphosis start, and, and could you envision this kind of start for him? Yeah, I mean, we've always seen what he's capable of in practice, and you know, in open gyms over the summer, even he's just a you know, long, athletic guy that has the ability to impact the game both offensively and defensively. So, you know, to be able to see him kind of come into his element a little bit has been exciting for everybody to watch. Thanks, Mark. Yeah.